So lots of us have been to the hospital at least once in our life, right? And that means doctors have a list of patients that they need to keep track of. In today's house call, we're going to learn more about an effort to keep all of our doctors connected so that you can get the best health care possible. We're joined this morning by Dr. Jim Osborne. He is the Senior Director of Population Health for the Triad Healthcare Network and a member of the Cone Health uh, member of Cone Health Network. I get it right out right. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> it's good to see you this Thank morning, you Dr. Osborne. Nice so to be here. Let's talk a little bit um, uh, about what this means. When you talk about keeping track, it it helps uh, patients in many, many different ways, doesn't it? Yeah, and so just to give you a little background, Triad Healthcare Network, or THN as we call it, is what's called an accountable care organization or an mm -hmm. ACO. And it's composed of community physicians, Cone Health's physicians and its hospitals and other facilities. And, and what we're trying to do actually, believe it or not, is lower health care costs and improve the quality of health care. We have 1,200 doctors, more than 1,200 doctors, wow. and we manage the care of over 200,000 patients. Wow. So to do that, you can't just do it while the patients are in front of the doctor. Right. You got to use other strategies. And we use these strategies called population health. And I like to define population health very simply, and it's uh, keeping well people well keeping chronically ill people stable and out of the hospital, and helping people near the end of their lives make their best and most informed decisions. So when you talk about the chronically ill folks, you're talking about folks that, that um, may be being treated for different diseases like cancer, diabetes, that type of thing? Yeah, heart failure, COPD, those kinds of things as well. And, and the problem here is that um, is we haven't always known where to go with these patients, right. so we use a lot of data. We use data that we gather from different sources, from different electronic medical records, from labs, from x-ray facilities, and things like that. And that data guides our interventions. Because we, what, what we want to do is maintain patient health right. and help them be able to do the things they want to do in life. And when we do that, the quality of care is better, it's more efficient, and it's coordinated. Well, and because sometimes patients have more than one doctor. They may have their primary care physician, their heart doctor, maybe they have an oncologist, that type of thing, right? Yeah. Well. It's surprising how many uh, yeah. doctors many patients have. I'd yeah. say many patients have more than one doctor, and it's amazing how many patients uh, some, I mean, how many uh, doctors some patients have. Yeah. Um, and so part of population health strategies also is to promote coordination and exchange of information so that each doctor knows exactly what his or her role is in helping the patient maintain their health status. So it's a true team approach when it comes to it. It absolutely is. You, uh, the day of uh, the solo doc knowing everything about their patient has passed because it's just too complicated a system. Yeah, that's great though that you're simplifying it with the, the 1,200 doctors that you have working right. together for the benefit of the patient. Yep, and if you want to know more, we have a website, Triad Healthcare network.com and you can select a THN provider look at other resources that might help manage your care and keep you healthy as well awesome thank you so much for being here my pleasure great thank you. information again if you want to find out more about the triad healthcare network you can go to their website triadhealthcarenetwork.com or for more information on living a healthy life you can always go to the cone health website at conehealth.com slash wellness dash matters House Call on Fox 8 is sponsored by Cone Health.